Turn Signal with Nima Reza. Many Americans are still asking the question, what's the big deal about health care reform? Well, now there's a place you can get answers. Family Research Council Action will be holding a webcast. Tom McCluskey, vice president of FRC Action, says the town halls of August made one thing clear to lawmakers. I think what we've been seeing, uh, both beyond, even beyond the pro-life community, is that constituents understand much better than legislators what's going on uh, with this health care reform and what needs to be in it and what doesn't need to be in it. You're seeing over and over and over again in both red and blue and purple districts members speaking up, at, or I'm sorry, constituents speaking up and knowing more about the legislation than the members themselves. And that is a potentially dangerous situation considering just what is at stake. Current legislation as it stands in both the House and the Senate would force taxpayers to fund abortion across the nation. Uh, there are a number of amendments offered to counter that in both the Hill, both the House and the Senate, and they were shot down by Democrats on the committee. Additionally, McCluskey says the bill gives government bureaucrats unprecedented influence over health decisions that have always been made by the patient and the family. And lastly, conscience protections. Healthcare professionals and hospitals should not be forced to participate in actions that they deem would be against their beliefs, against their faith. The webcast is scheduled for September 10th. It'll run from 8.30 to 9.30 Eastern. Go to frcaction.org to register. More reasons for the webcast? The last time FRC Action held one, they had more than 70,000 hits. And some members of the mainstream media are beginning to point out that pro-lifers are correct on abortion funding.